Hey guys, Gaz here, and in this video I'll be showing you how to download and install the new pre-release for Minecraft. So you can see here that uh, in this case we are at pre-release 4, and uh, you can see I'm at this page, it's actually my blog, and uh, this is where I link everyone to when um, a new pre-release comes out. Um, it gives you all the changes of what is in the new pre-release and it uh, gives you a nice layout to the client and server. So in this case we're going to download the new client and uh, it's going to prompt you to download and uh, in this case 6 seconds and um, we're going to go down to uh, the downloads folder once this is done and you can see open folder and uh, it actually saves as a .zip file so in this case a lot of people always get uh, kind of nervous and they don't know what to do and uh, what you do is go into properties and edit the text to a dot .jar and from there just press yes and there you are you have uh, the minecraft.jar as well as that you can just go and edit the text as if you're normally doing it and just go dot .jar so whatever suits you really and uh, that's pretty much the first part done so now we're going to go into search and uh, we're going to find the minecraft folder a lot of people can't find it so this is how you find it you go percent app data percent and you can see here the very top folder is roaming from there you want to go to dot minecraft which is at the very very top of these folders and uh, straight away now you're in the minecraft folder and this is the main folder where you can put texture packs and screenshots and saves and so on um, but you want to go into the main folder which is bin but before you do that you want to back up all your folder all your folders because if this is a faulty pre-release um, it can delete all your worlds which is pretty pretty bad so uh, you just want to copy and paste it into a different folder wherever you feel is the best place um, and then after you do that then go into bin and then uh, you can see here this is the main folder minecraft.jar so you want to go over to back over to your downloads folder and click drag drop and move and replace and you now have the new pre-release for minecraft so um, it's pretty easy once you have it done but um, <laughs> this really wraps up the um, ins installation guide on the pre-release for Minecraft. And uh, if it, if this was any helpful, guys, please like the video. Um, it kind of lets me know um, how much people out there have actually helped and uh, motivates me to make more. So uh, thanks, guys, for watching, and as always, have a nice day.